In this short video, we're going to be taking a look at how to create grass using particle systems. We used particle systems to make rain in the previous video. I'm going to link it up here. You can watch that if you'd like. Uh, but today we're going to be taking a look at grass. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing we're going to do is delete this cube, add in a plane, scale that a little bit, go to particle properties, hit plus, go to hair, and this is going to be our grass. The hairs you see here, that's what's going to be our grass. And we don't need our grass to be this tall off the ground. So go to hair length, turn it down to about 0.2, There we go. I like that. Now let's go ahead and add some more grass because I feel like we, we're going to need a little more grass here. So I'm going to change that to 5,000. All right. And as you can see now, we have straight hair. And grass is usually kind of bendy, kind of, you know, kind of random. So go to advance. We're going to add that effect. Go to physics and go to Brownian. And here you can change the sort of the bendiness or the randomness of the grass. I'm going to keep it to about 0.5. And now let's go ahead and texture this. Add a color. Make it like that. Go to material preview. And there we go. We have our grass. Now I could end the video here, but I'm going to do a short animation uh, of just the grass swaying from side to side. So what we're going to do is I am going to add a force field and we're going to add wind and we are going to move it. Let's move it up. GX. And as you can see, the wind seems to be blowing from there. So go to the object data properties, or is it the, sorry, it's the physics properties. Oh, it seems like I accidentally added force. We're going to add wind and we are going to rotate this along the Y by 90 degrees. And now we can sort of animate the grass. So we have our first clip here. We're going to click on this. It's going to save the force of the wind here. And then we're going to lower it. So that way the grass sways the other way. Oh, I forgot to take this. Let's just take it to 20. And let's make this negative 0.1. Animate that. Move this over to 50. Change this to 0.3. Move this over to 80. Move it to negative 2. Let's actually put this at 90. Move it to negative 2. Add another keyframe. And now if I go back to the very beginning and hit my spacebar, it's going to slowly animate it. Now it looks a little too fast. So you can obviously slow this down. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick these here. All right, with those three picks, I'm just going to move them over maybe to around there then deselect this one move this one over and then deselect this one move it over a little more all right so now this is going to cause variation in how the wind is blowing and also it'll be a little slower as you can see it's moving side to side here so that is our animation for the grass and how we create grass using particle systems Leave a comment below if you guys, or how yours turned out. And if you guys have any questions, obviously you can ask me in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.